Joe's Golden Garage here. 2008 Nissan Versa. New car trade-in at Cleveland, Florida with 130,000 miles. I know this car is so irrelevant, but man, I used to have one of these. I bought one brand new in 2010, and I loved this car. <laughs> it ain't much to look at. It's not. But man, it was so economical. It was cheap to buy new. I bought it brand new for 12,000 bucks. And plus, it has the biggest and roomiest back seat for a small car. I mean, I'm six, almost 6'3". Six and I've got the front seat all the way back. Has plenty of headroom. These are great economical cars if you're just looking for cheap transportation to get around. Now this one's a little beat up. It's an SL model, so it's the top of the line of the Versa. It's got a beat up door. Doors beat to piss. But these things make good cars. And it's a clean car. Whoever had it took pretty good care of it. Doesn't have any warning lights on. It's got good cold air. It's got a new set of Goodyear tires on it. Um, you know, it's 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 a little narrow, but still, it's a fun car, and it's got pretty good pet. I mean, it is a CVT, and it's Nissan's old CVT. <laughs> But if you buy an S and not an SL, if you buy just the S, you get a regular four-speed automatic, which that's what mine was. The SL makes it a CVT. They also offered a six-speed manual on one of these. Still a pretty peppy car overall. <laughs> not bad not bad 2008 with 130,000 miles it's got a busted cr or a cracked windshield it's got some dents and dings on the outside um, inside's pretty clean this will probably be a $1,500 car I would if I was guessing um, and it's probably worth it uh, the CVT seems to shift pretty good um, and like I said, there's no warning lights other than the tire pressure, uh, which probably just needs a little air in one of the tires, and that's it. But yeah, pretty neat little old car for the money. I've always liked these. They've had a special place in my heart. But anyway, y'all have a good one. See ya. Peace.